My name is James Cumberbatch and I would like to talk you through my entry for the Car Design News and Epic Games HMI competition. So what inspired my design thinking? So I currently drive a, it's about a 10 year old VW transporter van and the controls on the dashboard for that are extremely minimal. Um, they're not very flashy, they don't have lots of rich functionality, but they do exactly what you need to do when you're driving a vehicle. Uh, and as a result, many years down the line, I think they've aged very, very well. And I wanted to take this approach for a, uh, a touchscreen interface that I was going to build with Unreal Engine, keep things very, very minimal to begin with, um, but then layer on richer functionality uh, as I built out the experience. I've been using Unreal Engine for a, a number of years now, and I wanted to um, see how I could use the tools available with a, with a powerful 3D game engine and how you could adapt that for user experiences. Um, I've got a number of years building, designing and building applications on different platforms and different technologies, but I've never built anything in a game engine that could run in a car. So it, it was a really interesting area to explore, something that I haven't done before. And going forward, you know, in the years to come, when you think about fully self-driving vehicles, the opportunities for entertainment, commerce, and just pure fun in these, you know, built into these experiences is gonna really, really change the way we move and interact with our vehicles in the future. So I think it's a really gonna be a really exciting space. Okay, what tools did I use to, to build the application? So I used Unreal Engine 5. Um, most of the modeling was done in Cinema 4D and a bit of the pipeline work around the icons uh, was done in Houdini. Um, I rendered out the different sequences in Unreal Engine and then stitched them together for the final video in Adobe Premiere. 